Hey, today I'm going to be showing you how to change the names uh, and the uh, ID data for uh, boots in a boot pack. So you have to edit the boots.bin pile, which isn't easy, especially if you don't have the right uh, software. So what you need are two uh, two programs. One of them is Pez Editor by uh, EJOGC327, and there'll be a link to that in the description. And you can download it here, just click Mega. There's two versions, there's a free version and a donated slash paid version where you just make a donation to the uh, creator of this program and you get full access. The second thing you need is CPK browser and this lets you uh, open CPK files and extract the uh, necessary components. So first thing you need to do, so I'm just going to close this to show you from the beginning. First thing you need to do is open the editor. And uh, if you get the uh, free version, you just log in anonymously. I have the paid version, so I get given a username. But once I've logged in, I enter. Okay, so once you've entered, all of this will be blank. And you need to give it a file for the common, the uh, basically a folder destination for the common folder. So uh, for this, it needs to have a player, coach, player assignment bin, all of these files here that don't have a tick. These are all necessary. However, these files can't be accessed through the uh, installed game data. So what you need to do, you need to uh, go to data and this file here, it's called DT00X64. You don't actually need to edit this. All you need to do is just load it into this so you can edit the file you want. So what you do, you get another oh, sorry. folder, open cpk browser and uh, you drag this into here like this tools, extract all, you hit ok and then it will come out with this folder here it will uh, come to the same location so as you can see we have the common folder here that we needed and uh, what you need to do so you go back to this destination here oh, sorry. you go back to this destination here Copy it, load it in here, click assign URL. You want to edit the boots.bin folder. So what you need to do is just untick all of this. Now you want to load in the boot pack. So I've installed my boot pack. It's TIS009 boot pack that I'm using. And uh, go to boots, common, etc, pez database, boots.bin, open. I hit OK. Now it's going to load in all the uh, default files that it needs. It doesn't matter because you're not actually going to be uh, using those for the game. The only one you're worried about is the boots.bin file. And the program will save it regardless. So just to show you in game, I'm just going to go to the edit folder and uh, show you some boots. So for example, if I wanted to uh, edit the boots from a different boot pack, so you can only have one boot pack and if you combine boot packs, you can move some folders over but it doesn't let you change like, the name of the boots. So, uh, strip style. Here we go. Okay, so I've already done this for these boots. But if I wanted to uh, change, for example, the name to, uh, I don't know, Jaden Sancho's boots, right? Then I can go here. And uh, you can see this here. So you can change the uh, name, you can change the color, you can change the material. So you can, for example, add the material apply I'm just going to close this so I can restart it so you apply it you save and now you need to finish the check so after this is saved you can reopen you can reopen uh, PES 2020's Resider and uh, yeah that should let you add the boots that you need If you have uh, two separate boot packs and you want to add boots from one boot pack to the other one, then you need to move the uh, <clears throat> you need to move the folders over. So let's look at Cider and uh, see what it says. So if this worked correctly, then the materials on the Jaden Sancho boots should say Flyknit360 slash Nike Skin.
before it only said flying at 360. Sorry for the banging if you can hear that, some uh, building going on. The game takes quite long to load because there's a lot of mods installed on it. But yeah, if you guys would like to see a uh, separate video on how to combine boot packs or how to move uh, a couple boots from one boot pack to another one, then I can do that as well. Just let me know uh, what you think and if this works correctly, you can see Jaden Sancho's boots will have uh, the updated material name. As you can see, his material now for the boot says Flyknits 360 Nike Skin. So yeah, thanks for watching.